संसार दावा नलनीर लोका तराय कारुन घना घनत्यम प्राप्त सकलन गुनान वशा बंदे गुरसी चरणारबिन्दम महाप्रभु की तननित गीता बादित्रमातन मन सोरसेना रमांचकम पासु तरंग भाजो बंदे गुरसी चरणारबिन्दम संसार दावा नलनीर लोका जानाय कारण घना घनत्यम सप्त सकलन गुनार्न वश बंदे गुरसी चरणार बिन्दम श्रीविग्रहारा धननितनाना सिंगारतन मंदिर मार्जना दो श्रीविग्रहारा धननितनाना सिंगारतन मंदिर मार्जना दो तस्य भक्तां शनिजन यतोपि वंदे गुरसिंचरनारबिन्दम् तस्य भक्तां शनिजन यतोपि वंदे गुरसिंचरनारबिन्दम् संसार दावार नलनीलोको प्राणायकार घनाघनत्यम् प्राप्तशकल्लन गुनार्न वशा बंधे गुरसिंचरनारबिन्दम् चतुर्विधासी भगवत् प्रसाद सर्वान्नतितन हरिवक्त संघान चतुर विधासी भगवत् प्रसाद सर्वान्नतितन हरिवक्त संघान तेवत्री तिंगजत सदैवा तेवत्री तिंगजत सदैवा बंधे गुरसी चरणारबिन्दम् बंधे गुरसी चरणारबिन्दम् बंधे गुरसी चरणारबिन्दम् सिराधिका माधवयरोपार माधुर्जलिरा गुणरूपनाम नाम सिराधिका माधवयरोपार माधुर्जलिरा गुणरूपनाम नाम प्रतीक्षन स्वादनललोपासन प्रतीक्षन स्वादनललोपासन बंधे गुरसी चरणारबिन्दम् बंधे गुरसी चरणारबिन्दम् बंधे गुरसी चरणारबिन्दम् संसार दावानलंगरोको प्राणायकारिण घना घनत्यम् प्राप्तशकलन गुनान वश बंधे गुरसिंचरनारबिन्दम् निकुंजजुनारतिकेली सिद्धयि 
ಕುಂಜ ಜ್ಯೋನಾರತಿ ಕೇಳಿ ಸಿದ್ಧೈ ಜಾ ಜಾಲಿ ವಿದ್ಯುಕ್ತಿರಪೇಕ್ಷಣೀಯ ಕುಂಜ ಜ್ಯೋನಾರತಿ ಕೇಳಿ ಸಿದ್ಧೈ ಜಾ ಜಾಲಿ ವಿದ್ಯುಕ್ತಿರಪೇಕ್ಷಣೀಯ ತಾಕ್ಷಾತಿ ಬಲ್ಲವಶ ಬಂದೇ ಗುರ ಪ್ರಾಯ ಪಾ 
uh, of all the living entities, the human forms, they are very small number, four hundred. Asiti chaturang chayivo. Asiti means eighty and chatura means four. So eight million four hundred thousand species of forms. <coughs> so uh, prasanga ajaram pasam atmana. Atma is the same, spirit soul. He has got the same form, but they are different dresses. They are having different dresses. Just like we are sitting so many, as human beings we are the same, but we have got different dresses. Similarly, ātmā, the soul, the spirit soul, is the same. Uh, there is no difference. There were pandita samadarshin, one who knows what is the form of ātmā, he sees vidyāvinaya brahmane kavi hastani uh, samadarshin. He sees the animal, the cats and dogs and a learned brahmi, uh, samadarshin, samata, means not that brahman is equal to the dog. No, not that. But he sees that Brahmana is also a spirit soul and the dog is also a spirit soul. Uh. So this uh, conditioned life, dog has got a conditioned life, uh, I have got a conditioned life, we have got a conditioned life. We are all conditions under different and according to the condition we have got different bodies. Karmana Daivanatrena. These conditioned life, different forms of life, we have got Daivanatrena. By superior uh, superior administration. Uh, netrena means netritya, uh, leadership. Uh, so superior leadership. Uh, just like Jamaraj. Uh, karmana, according to my karma, he offers me some body. Dvayvanatrena. Jantar deha papat. Karanam guna sangha sadasat janma junish. Karma, guna karma, vibhagasa. Guna and karma, uh, just like here in the practical world, you can work as an engineer, karma if you have got the qualification. If you have got the qualification of a shopkeeper, you cannot act as engineer. That is not possible. If you have got the qualification of a teacher, education is, then you can become a teacher. See, the whole world is going like that. Guna karma, vibhāga. So guna means we are According to our uh, position or according to our mentality, we are uh, infecting some guna, sakarajatama guna. Uh, so guna karma, guna karma vibhāga. Very scientific this is. Uh, you can become, if you acquire the qualities of a brāhmaṇa, then, and if you work as a brāhmaṇa, then guna-karma vibhāgasa, you become a brāhmaṇa. If you have the qualities of a khatriya, and if you work as a khatriya, then you are khatriya. If you have the qualification of a mercantile man, businessman, and if you work as a businessman or cultivator, then you become vaśya. This is very scientific. Not that one is classified according to the birth. No, according to qualification. Just like there is a medical association. Medical association does not mean all the medical men in the association, they are born of the same family. No, they are born in different families. But because they have got qualification and working as medical men, they are admitted. 
as a member of medical association or member of bar association. This is practical. Similarly, if you acquire uh, the qualification of a brahmana, and if you work as a brahmana, then you are accepted as brahmana. Similarly, khatriya, similarly, bhusha. This is. Uh, it is. It is the authoritative statement of Narad. Jusahi jat lakshanam proktam varnabhi vanyakam. In the Bhagavad Gita, varnabhi vanyakam, how to decide to which class or which caste a certain man belongs to? Uh, that there are uh, symptoms. Satta saucham samam damam, kanti arjamam, dhyanam vijnanam, astikam, brahma karma svav. So, Narad Muni says, just say he just lakhanam proktam. These are the symptoms. Uh, so, if such symptoms are visible in another place, uh, then tatte no yobinidhi se. Siddhar Sanya has given his note that birth is not everything. Uh, one has to acquire the quality. Then he will be classified. So, uh, prasanga ajaram, uh, we are attached to some quality and some work. In this way we are getting different bodies, one after another. This body finished, we create another body. This life is creating uh, another body. This is called uh, prasanga, ajaram, attachment to the material qualities, we are conditioned. Uh, and <coughs> suppose we have got now human form of body, or uh, in a very rich family, that is all right, but it will not continue. Uh, you have to give it up. And any moment by the superior authority, when it is ordered, immediately please leave this position. You have to do it. This is called conditioned life. Uh, you cannot stay in any uh, status of life for all the days. If you think that I am American, I am very happy. Uh, that, that's all right, you are American, you are happy, or Indian, you are very happy. You have uh, chalked out your plan how to continue happiness. But nature will not allow you to stay. Devi Jesagunami, Mamamaya Duruttaya. As soon as nature will call back, please give up this post. Now take the post of a dog. Karmanada Imanatrana, you have acted. You are given the most exalted form of life, human being. You did not act as human being, you acted as a dog. Now you take the body of a dog. This is karmanāda imanitrīna. Therefore we must be very careful in this human form of life. <coughs> Our aim should be how to become a devotee. So to become a devotee, Krishna conscious, uh, because that is the path of liberation. Janma karma me dibbam ju janati tattata takta dihang punar janma naiti mamet. If you want to stop punar janma, uh, great, great personalities uh, in India, they used to go to the forest to stop this reputation of punar janma. Uh, just like Vishamitra Muni. Vishamitra Muni, when he approached Maharaj Dasarat to take with him uh, Ramchandra and Lakshman, they are boys, to kill the Taraka Rakhushi, uh, there was some disturbance. So although Vishamitra Muni could kill, but no, that was not the Brahmana's business. It was the to kill, it was the to, to punish, it was king's business. So therefore they approached. Uh, so at that time, Maharaj Dasara 
ग्रीटेड विषामित्रों ओ इष्टंग जत्तंग पुनर्जन्म जया आयो जस्ट लाइक व्हेन वी मीट अ फ्रेंड इफ इज अ बिजनेसमैन सपोज ही कम्स टू सी मी आई एम ए सन्नासी एंड ही इज अ बिजनेसमैन आई आस्क हिम हाउ योर बिजनेस इज गोइंग ऑन बिकॉज ही इज एंगेज इन दैट वे एंड the gentleman who comes to see me he will ask me sami ji how your preaching is going on he will not ask me how your business is going on so the punarjanma jayaya oishtam ah the brahmanas the learned rishis sages they are specially engaged for punarjanma jayaya uh, to conquer over the process of Repetition of birth and death—that uh, is the highest occupation. The every man is meant for that. Punat janma jaya. Uh, unless we conquer this process of punat janma, bhutta bhutta praliyate, and uh, if we simply waste our time like animals, eating, sleeping, sex in that course, and defense, then it is animal life. Uh, so. Uh, especially in this age, they cannot distinguish that what is the animal life and what is human life. Uh, they think the dog animal he is sleeping on the street, and I am sleeping on the twentieth floor of a nice apartment. Therefore, I am civilized. The shastra says no. Either you sleep on the street. Or in the twenty-fourth story of my apartment, you are sleeping. Uh, you are not doing any other thing. Simply, the dog is eating uh, without any plate. And suppose if you are eating in a golden plate, uh, that does not mean the taste of the food stuff has changed. No, the food stuff given to the dog on the street without any plate. And the food stuff given to me in a golden plate, the taste is the same, and the uh, value, a food value, is the same. So we have to see in that way. They have to improve the quality of eating, sleeping, mating. The, go- the dog is having sexual intercourse in the open street, and if we have sexual intercourse in a very sec- secluded place. And very nice beds, bedstead. That does not change the quality. Uh, therefore, uh, we should know it that simply by eating, sleeping, defending, and sex life, that is animal life. Uh, human life is meant for how to become free from this process of repetition of birth and death. Uh, that is liberation. So here we have discussed last night that prasangam ajaram pasam atma, the bondage, condition life, more and more tighten. Jagyarthi karman natru lu koyam karma bandhan. If you do not engage your life in activities of Krishna consciousness, that is called jagga, jagga purus. Jagga means To sacrifice for the satisfaction of the supreme person, that is called jagga. Ka atapungbi dijasreesta varna sama vibhaga sa varma sama vibhas sangsiddhi harito sano. If you want perfection of your activities, different men have got different activities. That's all right. But try to uh, make it perfect, sangsiddha, siddhae, brahma siddhae. We have discussed all these things. And how it can be done? Uh, sangsiddhi hari to janam. If you satisfy Krishna hari by your talent, by your activities, then you are successful. That should be the aim of human life. Sarva dharmaan paritajya maamekam. You don't try to. Engage yourself, entangle yourself uh, for repetition of birth and death. Uh, 
So how this can be achieved? That is suggested in the last part. Saiva sadhusu krita. The same attachment as you are attached to these material activities, if you transfer that attachment to a sadhu, then your life is successful. Oh. We have got attachment for money, we have got attachment for woman, we have got attachment for nice house, we have attachment for our country, for our society, for our families, and so on, so on, so on. Uh, that attachment is called ajaram, pasam. Pasam means rope. And if you are tied up with a rope, hands and legs, uh, then you are helpless. Uh, so we are actually uh, tied up. Uh, the Vijjisha Gunavai, that word is called Guna. Guna means rope. Uh, we are tied up. Uh, we are not free. And it's like we are trying to go to the moon planet so many years, but because we are not free, still we have not been successful to go there. So there are so many planets in the, within this material world. Uh, we can go. We have got now machine, very speedy machine. But why cannot go? Because we are conditioned. Uh, you cannot go by your whims. You must be qualified to go to certain planets. That is stated in the Bhagavad Gita. Janti Deva Brita Devan Pitrin Janti Pitri Brita Bhutani Janti Bhute Ja Madhyaji no Pi Janti Maam. So if you want to go, you must qualify yourself. Otherwise it is not so easy. Just like if you want to go to America, you must have qualification, you must have your visa, you must have your passport, you must have the so many things. Uh, if you want to be immigration or if you want to go as a visitor, similarly, the other kind. If there are so many processes you have to undergo from this country to that country, is it possible that you want to go to another planet without such qualification? Uh, this is futile attempt. It is not possible. Therefore you are conditioned. It is called condition. Uh, we cannot go, we cannot move freely uh, without being sanctioned by the superior authority. Uh, so we generally say not a blade of grass moves without the sanction of God. Similarly, uh, we cannot do anything. David Jesa, God does not take uh, as a superficial personality. Parasa Shakti Vividhaivasyati. Natasa Kajam Karanancha Vidyat. In the Veda, Sita Sata Rupanisha. He hasn't got to do personality, but he has got so many agents to do. Parasa Shakti Vividhaivasyati. He has got something. They will do. You are not free even to twinkle with your eyelids. That is also being controlled. Uh, that information. Uh, you are moving this hand very freely, it can be immediately paralyzed. Uh, I am claiming that I, it is my hand. What is your hand? It can be stopped immediately. Your eyes, it can be stopped. So we must know that you are conditioned. Uh, so this is conditioned life. And uh, how you can improve conditioned life? Therefore, our business is how to become liberated from all these conditions. And that can be done only by saiva sadhu sukrita moksha dharma uh, If you, you have got so many attachments for so many things, if you turn all this attachment to a sadhu, sadhu saṅga sadhu saṅga sarva sastrika Chaitanya Mahapur advised, Sadhu Sangha, Sadhu Sangha, Sarva Shastri Kod. In all the Shastras, they advise uh, they, to associate with the Sadhu. Tasmad Dushinga Mutsajya, Maja Sadhu Samagama. Even Chanaka Pandi, the great politician, Maja uh, Sadhu uh, Samagama, Asa Sangha Tayagi Vaishnavacha. Uh, one uh, grihastha 
Vaishna, householder Vaishna, he asked Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, what is the duty of a grihastha, householder Vaishna? Uh, so Chaitanya Mahaprabhu said in two lines, Asasanga Tayaji Vaishnavacha. Don't associate with nonsense or sadhu. Hmm. Asasanga Tayaji Vaishnavacha. One line. Uh, a Vaishnava's behavior is to give her the association of demons, non devotee. Uh, because sadhu means devotee. Sadhu Reva Samanta. So it is uh, very, um, I mean, to say, essential to avoid the company of a sadhu. But at the present moment, it is very difficult to find out the association of sadhu. Therefore, our teeny effort is this Krishna consciousness movement to create an association of the sadhus. So people may take advantage of this association uh, and then his life becomes liberated. And that is the aim and object of this association. It has no other object. People may say so many nonsense things, but our only object is that as therefore you have given the name association of Krishna conscious person. Krishna conscious means sadhu. Because Krishna says, Yogi nama pi sarvi saṁ madgata antarātmana sadhyāvān bhajati juma samai jukta He is first class yogi. Who is that? Who is always thinking of me. And Krishna is advising, manmana bhavamad bhakta mad jāji māng namaskū. Four things only. It is not very difficult thing. Always think of Krishna, manmana, and without becoming devotee, how you can think of Krishna? You can think of your business, you can think of your dog, or you can think of your family, or you can think of your lovable object, woman or man, and so many. But Krishna says, Manuna Bhagavad You think of me. Because we have to think something. Without thinking, you cannot remain. This is the simple process. Instead of thinking so many things, you simply think of Krishna. The sadhu will teach that. Sadhu's business is why sadhu, to associate with sadhu, sadhu sangha. The sadhu will not teach any, anything else. Adho sadhya tato sadhu sangha. This is the process of making spiritual advancement. If you have got any faith for making spiritual advancement, then you must uh, associate with sadhus. Adho sadhya, just like here people come, uh, here there is no other thing because here all the boys and girls and the boys, they are concerned with Radha Krishna. That's the whole business, whole day's business, whole night's business is Radha Krishna. Ah, from early morning at three o'clock to night, ten o'clock, they have only business of Radha Krishna, that's all. Therefore they are sadhu. Therefore they are sadhu. This is the symptom of sadhu. And so many people are criticizing. So many enemies we have got. We are not getting the sanction because there are so many enemies. We are creating nuisance. We are chanting Hare Krishna mantra, that is nuisance. This complaint is going to the police. Uh, so that is very difficult. Uh, therefore, a sadhu is advised, titik sabo, tolerate, tolerate all this nonsense. What can be done? We have no other alternative to tolerate. Nobody is coming to help us. Our business is so tangled stuff because we are trying to create one temple. So many enemies, they are giving hindrance. You cannot do it. Therefore, titik sava. You have to remain sadhu. You cannot become a sadhu. You have to tolerate. What can be done? Hmm. Tikik sava karunika. 
At the same time, you have to become merciful. Uh, you know what has happened in this place, Hare Krishna land. So much attack by the police, by the municipality to break this temple. Uh, so we could have gone. So what is the use of taking so much botheration? Uh, we have got hundreds of temples outside India. In Bombay, people are not liking. Let us go out. No. Karunika. We have come to distribute Krishna consciousness movement. We must tolerate and give this message to the people. Karunika. Very merciful. In spite of whole trouble. Uh, what is the use of these boys, these American boys, they have come to help me. Uh, not that they are hungry, they have come here. No. Uh, my mission is that you American, you chant Hare Krishna so that India, people of India will see, oh, Americans, they are also chanting, why not ourselves? It is our property. Uh, but unfortunately, so much dull brain, but that is not coming. But still we have to do it. Uh, we have to tolerate and we have to become karunika. Uh, Mm. There was, it is said that uh, paradukha dukhi, karunika. Uh, why karunika? Why you should, why you want to be merciful? No, paradukha dukhi. Ki, uh, ki paam budhi, just tamaham prabhat. A Vaishnava business is paradukha dukhi. Uh, a Vaishnava understands that these people, they are engaged like cats and dogs in sense gratification. They are misguided and they will be next life. They will be punished for this misguidance. Let us do something for them. This is karuni. Uh, karuna. Karuna, out of mercy. There is no question of getting something, money. Uh, no, money we have got sufficient. Uh, just to become merciful upon this fallen condition so who are suffering on account of becoming animalistic without any Krishna consciousness. Therefore the preacher, the sadhu, these are the sadhu, tritiksa, tolerant, never mind, uh, whatever uh, hindrances and tribulations they are offering to us, never mind, tolerant, tritiksa karunika suhida Suhido, when their heart is so nice, su means nice, and hido means heart. They have no other desire. Uh, suhido, suhido means that like there are different words. Uh, mitra, suhido, bandhu, uh, in Sanskrit is very perfect language. Suhido, suhido means a person who is always thinking of welfare for others. He is called Suhida. Otherwise, Kurida. The ordinary person, they are thinking how to uh, uh, make him subdued, how to make him defeated in competition. That is the polluted heart. And the Vaishnava, uh, he is always thinking how a man can be saved from the clutches somewhere. He is called Suhida. Uh, he has no other desire. Srihida Sarvadehina, not for my brother or family, but Sarvadehina, for all Dehis, all Dehis. It is not that, that this human, this like, here, nationalism. What is this nationalism? Nationalism means to take care of the human being and send the cows and goats to the slaughterhouse. This is going on, nationalism. What do you mean by nation? Uh, nation, the definition is any living being born in that land, he is a national. Uh, so the cow is not born, the tree is not born in this land. Uh, but because they are not Krishna conscious, they cannot be kind to all the Dehis. Dehi means anyone who has got this body. 
So somebody has got body, human being, somebody has got the cow's body, somebody has a dog's body, somebody has a tree's body. Uh, <coughs> so uh, then the Vaishnav is so kind that Sri uh, Dasaru Dihina. He is kind not only to the human being, to the cats, dogs, to the trees, to the plants, to the insect. A Vaishna will hesitate even to kill one mosquito. Sarvadehina. Not that I shall take care of my brother. I am good and my brother is good. No. Sri uh, Das Sarvadehina. These are the Vaishnava qualifications. Titik Sabakarnika. Because he is living in that way, why others will be enemy? Or he does not create enemy. They become enemy out of their own character. Chanakya Pandit says there are two crooked animals or envious animals. What is that? One man envious. Without any reason he becomes envious, and there is one serpent, envious. Without any fault it will bite, and your death. Sarpakrura khalakrura. Similarly there are men, without any offense, they will become enemy. The crooked man is more dangerous than the serpent. Why? Mantra sadi sarpa. Sattva, the serpent can be subdued by mantra, by chanting, snake chanting mantra, or by some herbs. Khalake in anivarjati. The man envious, it cannot be subdued. Therefore, he is more dangerous than the serpent. So, we are in this society, human society, because we are spreading Krishna consciousness. The kuru, which is more dangerous than the snake, they are puddings putting so many impediments, uh, but we have to tolerate. We have no other alternative. Be peaceful. What can be done? Depend on Krishna. Thank you very much. Not afraid to die, and says that he's not suffering. How do he's a madman. Who is caring for madmen?
very easy to convince some people that they're not their bodies. It is not very easy to convince them that they're not their minds. Is there something, some way we could explain that? That will take time. How can you expect? In one minute everyone will understand everything. He requires education, time. If he is prepared to give the time, then he will understand. <coughs> not that within five minutes, ten minutes he will understand the whole thing. That is not possible. He is a diseased man. He requires treatment, medicine and diet. In this way he will understand. A diseased man, if he doesn't care for medicine, diet, then he'll suffer. That's all. Yes? Anyone? No? Yes, We've been here lifetime after lifetime performing impious activities. Well, does it mean that we have to be here lifetime after lifetime performing impious activities to our, our simple reactions. Mm-hmm. Yeah. We have been here for many lifetimes performing sinful activities. So is it possible to counteract all those sinful activities in one lifetime or does it require many One lives? minute. That is Krishna consciousness movement. One minute. You are not reading Bhagavad Gita? What Krishna says? Sarva Sarman Paritajya Mami Kang Saranam Braja Angta Sarva Pape Bhavakshayami. You surrender to me, give up your all business. I'll give you relief from all sinful reactions. Immediate. Predicas one minute. <coughs> My dear Krishna, I was forgotten. Now I understand. I fully surrender to you. And immediately free from all things. Without any reservation, without any politics. If you fully surrender, Krishna is assuring. He reassures. Don't worry whether I will be able to, to give you relief from all things. It is guaranteed. You do this. <coughs> so how much time it requires to surrender to Krishna? Immediately you can do that. Surrender means you surrender and what? As Krishna says, that is surrender. <coughs> what Krishna says to do? Manmana bhavavad bhakta madhyaji maangnamaskuru. Four things. You always think of me and you become my devotee, you worship me and offer your respect, full of your senses and you do these four things. That is full surrender. Mami Vaishasi, Asangsa. Then you come to me without any doubt. Everything is there. Uh, Krishna has given everything fully. If you accept it, the life is very simple. There is no difficulty. Yes? How long do you say it is before Krishna comes to this planet again in physical and human form? Not quite. Anyway, what is your Australian conclusion? Let me know. The opinion is something else. Oh. Anyway, I give you the right figure. Four million, according to American and English calculation. Four million, three hundred thousand years. And multiply it by one thousand. And? What it comes according to English calculation? Four billion, four billion three hundred million. Huh? Four billion three hundred. That is twelve hours, and add again twelve hours night. Then eight billion. Six hundred million. So Krishna comes after this period. In one day, after one day, a Brahma he appears. <laughs> 